Hey up everyone and welcome back. So I'm going to continue on with the game now. So yep, yeah, I think we're still on chapter 5, Day of the Hunter. So yeah, we, we got um, a letter or a note saying I can help. And it was Craven the Hunter. So, was it, was it called Craven? Some, I can't pronounce his second name. Is it Craven or something? Anyway. So now, and yep, I thought I'd just change my suit to the classic black suit. So yeah, let's... Let's go. And I might go to the arcade after this mission and then try and unlock the, um, um, the superior Spider-Man suit. Because, um, yeah, if you... you know, let's just do this. Seismic blast. Okay. It's like a bouncy house, am I right? Did your mom tell you you could be anything you want? Because she was wrong. I wish they had it. Hello. I wish I had this in the, you know, new Spider-Man game. But Some days you just got it. Spider-Man! I like. Impressive. But you are still raw. Inexperienced. Really? I was experienced enough to beat your friends. I am Russian, but I am no friend to those pigs. My name is Sergei Kravenov. Sergei. Men call me Craven the Hunter. So you left me that note. Huh. Judging from the wet. You're one of those crazy reality show guys who runs around naked in the woods eating bugs. <laughs> How can you help me? I can make you a true hunter. Not just a boy pretending to be a man. Should you wish to accept, you may find me here. Until we meet again. Okay. Why didn't you get me pictures from the Fisk Osborne press conference? Oh, sorry, Mr. Jameson, but I've got school. You know, life outside the job. In my day, your job was your life. A press pass is wasted on you. That's the first time we're here, Triple J. <sighs> Actually, I just got an idea for using my press pass. What? Gotta admit. It'd be nice not to feel like I'm fighting this battle on my own. Is Craven someone I can trust? Craven obviously doesn't know who I really am when yeah. it comes to my house. I don't know. I've always worked best alone. 
But then again, I've never tried it any other way. If Craven can teach me his hunting techniques, I won't have to rely on police broadcasts to find bad guys. It's not like I tell Craven my real name. And I'll be on guard for any kind of double cross. I've never had formal training in how to fight. Craven's methods could come in handy if I ever lose my powers. You mean like we saw we saw some powers in the first <sighs> Okay. Game. Don't be nervous. You need information on Craven and you've got a press pass to get it with. <laughs> Easy peasy. Never mind that if he finds out you're a photographer and not a reporter, he'll have you stuffed and mounted. Yeah. Oh yeah, right, we're going to the yeah, right, okay. Let's do it. I'm not gonna do the races because I'm rubbish at them. Day of the Hunter. Right, okay, let's do this. Uh, Mr. Kravenoff? It's me, Peter Parker, from the Daily Bugle? We spoke on the phone. The, the door was open. Mr. Kravenoff? Bloody hell, it's got a good, nice home, hasn't it? Like a museum. <laughs> oh, I apologize for startling you. I am Craven. Please forgive my theatrics. I merely wish to demonstrate my skills. The videos online do that pretty well. I saw you take down that Siberian tiger with your bare hands, without hurting it. Tigers are endangered. I simply relocated the beast for its own safety, as well as that of the local villagers. True hunters wish to conserve the natural world. It is where we find peace. You're a long way from the natural world. I craved a new challenge. I came here to hunt the monsters Oscorp created. The cross species. The deadliest combination of animal and human. I ended their threat. But I grew fond of your city. And your city grew fond of me. <laughs> and I decided to stay. Except now you're hunting normal people. No. Only criminals. Only those who prey on their fellow man have anything to fear from me. Oh, right, okay, we're doing the options thing now. This new task force is sending a pretty strong message. No vigilantes. Ah, I do not trust them. They are paid for by Fisk. I am sure you've heard the rumors of his illegal activities. Sure, everyone has. But no one can prove it. And the police seem okay with him. Because he has paid those who are corrupt. Yep. The rest are desperate to avoid looking incompetent. Well, the public is desperate for an end to the crime wave. I have only one agenda. To get results. Based on my experience, uh, research, the police aren't big fans of vigilantes. The police had their chance to stop the crime wave. They failed miserably. I, uh... I don't think they like being reminded of that. I do not wish to insult them. But it would be a far greater crime to have the power to help, but to refuse to act. Would you not agree? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I would. Yeah, I was just, I was just wondering. It's pretty raining, isn't it, there? I was thinking, yeah, but we entered it during the daytime. It's all of a sudden it's night. Oh, whatever. Is man really the most dangerous game? In their own way, yes. But men are merely highly evolved animals. The current crime wave provides fascinating opportunities to study them. 
the patterns of the various factions. And what are you finding out? That criminals are not unlike beasts. They have hunting grounds, specific behaviors. Many travel in packs, but there are differences. Such as? Animals prey on others for survival. Only human beings are willfully cruel. Hmm. Okay, end conversation. Conversa finish conversation, sorry. So you're saying you feel a responsibility to use your power to help? Yes. To have such power and not use it is to be unworthy of it. Uh, well, thanks. I, I think our readers will find this very interesting. Good, good. I must take this call. But please, look around. Take pictures of anything you wish. Oh, thank you. Yes. No, I said tranquilizer darts. No, I have no interest in automatic weapons. They require no skill. I am an artist. I don't know if that, if that same guy that does Wolverine's voice in some of the games, but uh, what am I taking pictures of? Oh. Couldn't ask for a better picture. Me neither. Um, is it that a clock I'm taking a picture of? Sofa? <laughs> oh, oh, it's this, isn't it? Duh. Um. Perfection. Uh, and like a red. What are these? Can I take a picture <laughs> of it? More angry texts from Jameson. Either he can't type, or he just invented a new swear word. Now, shall let's take a picture of... Oh, gosh. Great composition. Pardon the interruption. Would you care to see my latest trophies? Uh, not really. <laughs> I don't want to see him. I've been spending so much time as Spider-Man, I feel naked without the mask on. Man, am I gonna need so much therapy. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! You're gonna need so much therapy. That's good, is it? Oh yeah! Yeah, I'm, I'm just, um... Seeing if there's more of these things. It sounds like bloody insects. We go... Whatever it was like. Another one. I'll take that! Why is... I thought I was glowing then. I was thinking, what the freaking hell? What the hell? I'm just... anyway... What's that? Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, um... Bloody hell, sorry, I'm wonk wonking? I'm walking like a wonky, donkey person. Anyway... I thought there was one. Just what I want! Right, let's talk to Craven and see what he wants to show us. Cross species. <laughs> Beautiful. Uh, don't we know it? Are they not? I thought Spider Man captured them. An inadequate solution. They escaped. So you killed them? To save the lives of their victims, yes. But also in self-defense, they were deadly opponents. I know. I mean, I can imagine. Ugh, again. Right, you can speak. When do you consider it okay to kill? When there is no other choice. I do not take life lightly. But when it is necessary, I do not hesitate. If my failure to act cost the life of an innocent person, I could not live with myself. I know what you mean. It's the kid. Why did I say that? Anyway. They all had superhuman powers. How'd you beat them? I have trained myself to the peak of human ability. 
and learned many natural means of enhancement. Not drugs, like the scum who pollute the streets, but the secrets of native cultures. Herbs, potions, mysteries forgotten by so-called civilized man. Hunting criminals? Some people might wonder if you're the carnage killer. Ah, he is no hunter, but a brute, a savage. His very existence is offensive to men like myself. So even though he's hunting criminals, you'd like to take him down? Of course. He dishonors what I do. Without honor, Peter, the hunt means nothing. Okay, let's wrap it up now. Well, last question. Is there anything you haven't accomplished yet? Ah, uh, yes. I would like to leave a legacy when I am gone. Pass my training to a protege. My only family is a brother who... Well, he chose a different path. I never had a son, but... Perhaps... Uh, forgive me. I am becoming melancholy as I get older. So, do you have what you need, Mr. Parker? Yeah, I think I do. Okie dokie, let's just look at these quickly. Wait, oh, that's that scorpion thing we fought, isn't it, in that? Uh, what's this? Oh, right, that's meant to be like... That's that stupid, um, I forgot what it's called now. And I take it that... Oh, that's that stupid thing we fought. I forgot what that's called. Ooh, I wonder what's behind here. Can I look here? No. <laughs> anyway, let's go before Craven decides to... You know. Bloody hell, I thought I was a cat then. Anyway, I'm just gonna run. And go. Because Triple J is probably wondering where we are. It's a bit creepy on night, at night time, isn't it? This. Let's. Go exit Craven's loft into the de 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 into the lion's den. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna leave it there for now, and I will catch you all in a bit. Bye.